Hello, my name is Philip Bloom and I'm a professional filmmaker. For the past five years, I've been messing around and using 360 cameras and I've loved the possibilities. But for video, they've never offered me the quality that I've needed. That is until the Insta360 Pro came out and suddenly it was there, a tool that I could use for my work. And now, with the Pro 2, it's gotten even better. A 360 video can be used for all sorts of different types of filmmaking, not just the sort of stuff that I do, but you always will need a really high quality to really capture things in the most realistic and natural way possible. And that's what the Insta360 Pro 2 does. The Pro 2 has a lot of resolution. In fact, it shoots 8K and you need that because when you put on a headset and crop in, it's gonna make a real difference for the audience watching it. And when you put it into 3D mode, it's gonna add a lot more depth. One of my favorite things to do is to come to some incredible places and some of my favorite places to capture what you see. So you can be transported into this amazing place. This is the city of London. This is my hometown. Behind me is St. Paul's and we're gonna start there and we're gonna capture different 360 shots all the way across Millennium Bridge over to Tate Modern. One of my favorite features of the Pro 2 is it now has flow state stabilization that we have in the One and the One X giving us lovely, stable, moving shots. So what I'm gonna do right now is walk along Millennium Bridge and do a 180 degree shot because if I did a whole 360, you'll see me. And I'm gonna hold this in a very strange way, but it should be cool. I may get some looks. Nobody's noticing me. So we're recording now and I want to get out of shot. I've kind of got three options. I can go really far away, not a good idea because it's not safe. The other one is I can get wet, jump over the side, not a good option because it's cold. The other one is just to be very subtle and pretend that I'm not here. The Pro 2 has much improved Wi-Fi over the previous model. In fact, even though the camera's all the way over there, I'm still connected on my phone. If I wanted to go even further, I could use far sights and go up to 300 meters away and have perfect, real-time, viewable image. But to be honest with you, it's London. There's no way on earth I'm gonna go that far away right now. I'm gonna stay here and watch it. So that's all the filming done from St. Paul's over Millennium Bridge to Tate Modern. Good timing, really, because it's just about to start raining. Now, I'm gonna put it all together. And when you do watch it with your headset on, if you want a truly authentic London experience, get a friend with a watering can, pour it over your head. Having a simple workflow is incredibly important. Once I've offloaded all of my footage, I wanna look at it straight away. And I can do because I've created a 4K in-camera stitched version and I can start editing it straight away within Premiere. In the meantime, my 8K version gets stitched and when I've finished my edit, it's all linked together. With the dedicated apps and the Premiere integration, it makes your editing so much easier. All in all, the Pro 2 is a fantastic all-in-one VR camera. And alongside the Insta360 certified program, filmmakers now have what they need to stay a step ahead in a competitive market.